With an edgier appearance, overhauled chassis, and even greater space, this all-new third-generation Lexus IS has positioned itself as the luxury compact sports sedan for the discriminating buyer. I suppose it would be remiss not to mention the BMW 3 Series, the sports sedan widely regarded as the prototype. But you know what? Not everyone longs for the Rondell, and so others, like Lexus, continue to persevere with their own take on what the sports sedan should be. With this new model, Lexus keeps the choices familiar with the IS250 and IS350, each with the option of rear or all-wheel drive. The new twist this year being that the F Sport package is now available across the entire model range. But this week, I've settled into an IS350 all-wheel drive, tricked out with the usual assortment of luxury options, taking the price from $42,595 to 47480 as tested. There is one conspicuous omission, navigation, and that's here on a car with the Luxury Plus technology package. What you see here instead is what Lexus calls the premium display audio system, with some cool new tricks like displaying the album art for sat radio signals and subscription-free real-time traffic and weather information. Beyond the inclusion of the Lexus family-faced spindle grille and a superb penning of the reimagined body, this IS is also wider by nearly half an inch and longer by almost three inches. Its new proportions and sweeping lines make it a understated stunner. But most of all, I love the way the IS is beautifully balanced in all regards. From behind the wheel, this car is always confident and composed. It performs all of its sports sedan duties with a sense of adroitness and unflappable ease. It's a car that just refuses to come unglued, showcasing its more rigid body and redesigned multi-link rear suspension that separates the shocks from the springs, also allowing for a roomier trunk. Sharp in its reflexes and direct with the driver's intentions, the IS350 is an all-wheel drive hero that can automatically send as much of its 277 foot-pounds of torque to the rear wheels. Providing the energy is the same 306 horsepower, naturally breathing 3.5 liter V6 as before. But unlike the rear drive car, which inherits the eight-speed transmission from the ISF this year, this all-wheel drive model soldiers on with the six-speed. Equipped with meaty paddle shifters, the characteristics of which can be tailored through the drive mode select. On this model, the choices include Eco, Normal, Sport, and Snow. While the powertrain is quite familiar, it's the changes to the chassis that make the IS350 all-wheel drive feel more competent and luxurious. And despite a small weight increase to 3,737 pounds, a 0 to 60 time of 5.7 seconds remains unchanged. The engine feels strong and linear and keeps most of its sound to itself. Gas mileage is rated at 19 MPG City, 26 Highway on premium. A modern industrial treatment has been applied to the interior with an eye-pleasing combination of metal, wood, and leather. The driver's seat, forward visibility, and ergonomics are all on point, making this one of those cars you just feel good driving. Some of my passengers found it a little narrow in the front, and the black matte finish of the center stack comes off as less than premium. But in general, the integration of high-tech driver's aids and more accommodating rear seats make the cabin a Lexus quiet and homey place to be. With the IS350 all-wheel drive, you get a well-behaved sports sedan and a business suit. It serenely does the job, but lacks the visceral experience of, say, a comparable Cadillac ATS but perhaps that's what the F Sport is for. It's not as fast, fuel efficient, or roomy as a 3 Series either, but it does cost less. Lexus has pinpointed areas of change here to make the IS a highly capable competitor. For Drive Time on Yahoo Autos, I'm Steve Hammes.